medyo masyadong malaki yung 32 to 10 nung second quarter na kinamata nito CSP medyo nabaon ng left run doon that's why uh, right now buti na lang maganda ng third quarter nila as Miller misses from the outside oo uh -huh. Lamang sila ng 2 points doon sa third quarter Pero they're still down by 10 Dito sa ball game natin Yesebio To uh, underneath to Morales Great pass there from Torres so, Very patient offense para dito sa CSP They're really finding the guy Na libreng libre Actually libre na si Torres doon Nakita niya si Yung big niya sa ilalim na libreng libre Kaya binigay niya naman that's the fourth assist of Torres. So, pal -pal -yu yun. As Pradelia misses on that attempt from the outside. Torres with a looper. Oh, sabi ni Torres, ako naman. Kung kanina, eh, pinasa, oh, may, pinasa niya kay Morales. Sabi ni Torres, ako naman. Magtatamot po na ako ngayon. Oo. Oh, <laughs> eh, libre-libre naman siya. Kaya talagang ititira niya. It's a 12-point lead now for... Uh, Yun. CSB Aray ko po Sayang That's a point plant Miss oh. from Pradelia Tumadagdag yung frustration Kapag kaganon Kometa walang mapuntahan Top there by a Letran player But Mondoa Gets it And score <laughs> Pinong pa pa doon yun to Oo, pambol na yun Nakuha pa ng CSB Talagang swerte sa ball Ito na yung pinakamalaking kalamangan natin At 14 Delia gives it to Wahao. Still can make any shot. As we will have another report from Glaisel Calvo. Glaisel. Gaya nga ng sabi sa akin itong si Justin Sanchez. Talaga namang puso ang pinapaira ng bawat kumanan. Emphasizing that it isn't only a matter of who outplays the other, but a matter of who has the bigger heart and desire for that W. And we can definitely see that the Blazers continues to wear their hearts on their sleeves to redeem themselves against the Knights today. Kahneman in this final frame, the pressure as the pressure continues to heighten, Coach Charles to call on his calls on the squad to remain composed so that they can convert more, saying that at this point they have no more points to give, so they have to be better. Makaisa kaya sila o muli ba silang maiisahan nitong Letran Knights? Malalaman natin yan, but for now, back to you guys. Thank you so much, Glyzel, as we're seeing here the statistics of I Ian Torres. Seven points, uh, four assists, and one still plus 32. <laughs> plus minus, plus 32. Sabi mo kanina po, di ba, na parang libre naman eh. Oh. That's the decision of an Ian Torres. Oh. Oh, look at that Ito assist. Naman, no? Di ba? That's the third time Ian Torres assisting itong si Roger Rondoa. Oh. Naso sobrahan sa pressure itong left right. Naiiwan nila yung mga tao sa ilalim. Libre, libre. 25 assists of Benil compared to only 11 of Letran. Masyado malayo yung diferensya. Difference of 14 assists. And turnover muna. Ang i-commit itong uh, Blazers as we see this Torres pass to Morales. Ayan yung kanina. Ayan yung muna. Na libre na siya sa stress. Ayan yung ulit, naman ha? yung pangalawa. Di ba? Hindi mo kailangan ipilit eh. Kasi eh, unang-una, much better percentage doon sa ilanin kaysa rito sa stress. Even if you're making a three, pero kung maiisipin ka, kung i-decisionin ka, mas madali yung nasa loob kaysa sa labas. And also credit to those guys na talagang gumagalaw para makita ni Torres eh. No? Oo, oh, yun. Ito pa yun. Villanar, Ray Paulette makaisa mula sa labas. Jim Boy gives it to Villanar underneath and he will score against the defense of Mondoa. Oo, oh, talagang tinilalabasan na siya ni Alin Liwag dito pero nagagawa ng paraan ito ni Pauha Villanar. Ito, sayang. Kala mo, still na. Mananatili ang bola dito sa Benil Blazers. Oh, ito na yung mga finisher ni Coach Charles. Ilang oras pa ba? 6 minutes and 23 seconds, Coach Charles. Making sure he will get his win. Yeah, hindi na siya nag-relax doon. Binalik na itong si Jack.
Justin Sanchez, Sonny Inon, and Alex Liwag sa ball game natin. Tometa drops it off to Alan Liwag! Great play! That's it, 38 assists. Ano, 26 assists. Little Benil Blazers. Estrada. Hands off. Five to shoot for Letran. Estrada steps back. Misses. Liwag. Tulak para kay... Tulak para dito kay Alin Liwag. Doon sa pwestuhan nila ni Pau Habilio na. Kaunti lang. Kaunti, kaunti lang. Parang hindi dapat ganun yung tulak. Mobile ka. Letran. Will maintain possession. Montesilio, wala mapasahan. Gives it to Habilionar. Tend to shoot for the blue shirt. Habilionar free from the top of the key. It's good! Hindi pa tapos si Pao Habilionar dito. The 7th free from Pao Habilionar. Sanchez mabibitawan. And the ball will go back to letter 9. Kailangan i-capitalize sila itong possession na ito. Oo, ang nangyayari dito. They were really hounds. Keep their defense, keeping their defense on Dipo Estrada. Kaya naman nalilibre itong si Pau Habilionar dito sa Ibabaw. They need more of that. They need more of that. You involve Habilionar and Estrada sa offense. Ito si Guahao. We'll try. Yes! Deo Guahao. Very seldom ni mga kuha ng ganyan. Alan Liwa drops it to Justin Sanchez. That's how you break the press. Oh. The Mudogul sila, they were gambling on the pass doon sa malapit. Kaya lang nakikita ng CSP yung pasa doon sa iba sa Ibabo. Ito na ito si Pao. Short. Balik ang bola dito sa Benil Blazers. They are up here by 11. 74 to 63. Apat na minuto, may gintang na lalabi. Inot, fakes. Drops it off to Sanko. And he will score. Another assist both. Oo, oo, oo. They were just attacking the lane. Tapos pagka may nag-help, hinahanap nila yung libre. Monhe gives it to Kuahao. Struggling in this game. Monhe. Hindi naman. Parang first two points pa lang ni Kobe Monhe dito sa ballgame natin after how many tries sa labas. Actually po, assist department is one of, you know, sabihin natin problem. But seventh ang letran in terms of assist with 15.6. They're on their average right now with 15. Kaya nga, kaya lang hindi pipiti yung average na lang. Oo, tapos ganito, yun na yung Top tip ng kinakalaban mo, hindi pwede ito. Good fall by Jim Boy. And when it comes to turnover, number 2 sila with 17 a game. Ito ka, Letran Knights. And right now, yun din ang pumapatay dito sa Letran ngayon. They have how many right now for Letran? Turnovers, 13. Close to their 17 a game. Wow. Let's see if this, they still have something in their pockets with 3 and 24 seconds remaining in this game. Labing dalawa na ang inahabol ng Lebron Knights. Coach Allen said kanina dun sa duckout, what he wanted for his players is to always play hard. And to see Coach Allen, we're now seeing some clips. It's just hindi lang sapat para rito sa Letran Knights itong mga effort nila. Squaha will try from the three, finally! For Teo Kuahao. May 3 minutes ba tayo dito? Hindi mo masasabi. Nakaisa na si Kuahao. Hopefully, meron pa. <laughs> Para dito kay Deo. And for Benil, what you want? Ay, Matipensan si Deo. Nakaisa na. 
Sanchez breaks and he will be fouled all the way up. And Coach Alan Ricardo, nagre reklamo doon, wala raw. Oh, oh. Pag tinignan mo kasi. <laughs> Nasa taas na eh. Nasa taas na eh. As Sanchez now on the line. For uh, two shots, he misses the first one. In terms of defense, Letran is 6. In terms of points allowed with 77.33. Allowing opponents with that number. Right now, Benil has 78. Montesilio. A 10-point lead by Benil Blazers with 2 and 36 remaining. Montesilio misses. Gives it to Estrada. Their second try. And then Siguahao fakes. Seven to shoot for the blue shirt. Four. Estrada takes it. Allen Liwag with a rejection. Uh-huh. Ganda nung help ni Allen Liwag doon. Hindi rin na dapat itong si Jim Boy sa kaliwa. Pero Allen Liwag na doon to protect that layup. And look at this. Alan Liwag just misses on the attempt. As you heard the last two minutes announcement, Kobe Mone misses. Too many misses on the layup. No, mga point block misses dito para sa letra. As we see this rejection from Alan Liwag. Kala ni Jim Boy libre na. Pero... Kobe Mone has four points right now, two out of ten sa field goal. Kasi we have seen a lot of point blank miss so, from uh, Kobe Mone. Eh. Ang lilapit nung hindi na nag-ibig siya. Meron sa mga libre sa labas, pero uh, So we're gonna have a review here. Kung kanino ang Medyo... last touch. Anong liwag yata ang last touch. Medyo close on that point. Ito si Dimaano sa likod. Ang daming kamay. Oo. Oh, Tinapig ni Dimaano sa likod. Ang tanong ay kung... Palabas. Baka tumaang tanong doon. Baka tumaang kay Aling Liwan. Ayun. Oo. Oh, okay. Ang ball will Bola stay. Letran. Letran. Oo. Dahil tumama kay... Liwan. Aling Liwan. Both 10-point game with 1 and 49 seconds remaining. Kaya pa? Pag titingnan mo, it's impossible. Pero, double digit lead sa ano. Pero kailangan nilang gawa ng paraan ng mabilis. Kung talagang gusto nila. Nahihirapan ito si Miller as Estrada. Ay na ba yung sinasabi natin. Oo, kailangan ng isang mabilis na atake. And they need to make a stop. And that's the first two points they need. As Sanko. They need to make a stop. Ito na. Gets it to Kinot. Oo. Oh. 1 and 37 remaining. Vinil swinging the ball. Liwag to the top. Inuubusin ang Vinil yung oras dito. There will be a foul here by Letran. Ayun lang. Yun naman yung nang hindi. Ayun, hindi ba yung pwede. Ito yung atake ni Jimbo Estrada. Kung papawal ka, as early as pag... Tawid pa lang ng front court. Pumawal ka na. Hindi doon sa nakadepensa ka na for 20 seconds, 18 seconds. Tsaka ka magpapawal. Di ba? Benil sitting on a 9-point lead here. 79 to 70. Enon swings to the corner and there will be an offensive foul to be called against Tony Enon. Oo, buti nilang offensive foul na tinawa ko ng Tony Enon. Dahil kung hindi, pasok na naman yun dito sa corner. Sabi na. Oo. Hindi na nakapreno doon si Tony Hino. Timeout muna. Itatawag ng Letran. They are down 70-79. Magtabalik ang NCAA Season 100.
What is up mga ka-NTA? Ako po si Christine San Agustin. Samahan po ninyo ako dito sa Mapuwa University para saksihan ang kanilang pep rally bilang suporta syempre sa kanilang mga atleta na ready-ready ng sumabak sa NTA Season 100. Let's go! As we're seeing right now, the Benilde Blazers games in the second round. Anim na sunod sunod. Napana awulimang sunod sunod. They will try to win their six. This is just a second round. They won. Oh, meron pa sa one the first, first round yet. Yep. At uh, tatlo pa after nito mga kalaban, Mapua, San Beta, LPU, mabigat din. Lahat, lahat actually. Itong mga susunod sa games na ano, eh, magkakadikit. That's how you ready yourself for, a play, oh, for the playoffs. Oh. Estrada, tend to work with. Estrada, man, gives it to Hanilionar. Kuha, how from the three? No! But the run will have another possession. Nunak! Scores the basket! So, kailangan nila ang dumipensa rito. They need to stop. And... As much as possible, pumol ka na agad. Ay, Jesus! Great play! Put back there from Alan Liwag. Oh, oh, great recognition by... Tony Inot. Para dun kay... Binigay kay Alan Liwag. Hindi na maka-second jump si Pau Hamilinar dun eh. Hindi na. Andra. Kailangan na nila bilisan dito. They can afford to, to use the shot, the clock. Here's yes, another three from Pau Havillionar. He's not yet done. Oh. His eighth three-point shot of the game. 31 points. Oh, 31 points. Eight rebounds, eight, eight, uh, three. Para, oy, libre, libre. Wala. Oh, make this done. Oh. I thought he came from out of bounds, but on the way last time, our referee is Justin Sanchez to Liwag, and he scores the basket. Oh, the pity is the only Liwag. That's their chance, Kela. Di pa rin nila nabuhay yung rebound. Let's try in a world of trouble here. As Benil, as Guaja will get another shot from the corner. Just a five-point game. They need a stop. Ancheta has the ball. They're still in the backcourt. Eight seconds. They need to foul here. Ayun lang. Four seconds. And the Benio Blazers will win this one against the Letra Knights. 83 to 78. Oh. Too late for the Letra Making their shots. Kaya lang, yun nga. They could have fouled on that last possession oh. by the uh, Benilde Blazers. At least, take a chances of making one of the two free throws. Pero yun nga. But you love the effort from the Letran guys. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They're still in this, uh, they're in the game early. Humabol dun sa third quarter. Oh, kaya lang yung 32 to 10. Nung second quarter. Yep. Medyo malaki yun. Medyo mabigat. And also, we're talking about the assist department. 30 assists versus the 21. As we're gonna hear first, the school here for both teams.
Caesars winning against the Knights 83 to 78. Magbabalik tayo para sa ating uh, post game analysis dito lang sa NCAA Season 100. season of all time. For the Cardinals, Skamis drives, fouled, count the basket! But it wouldn't be that without the greatest performances of all time. There is an abundance of talent in the league this year, and they are putting on a show every single time they step onto the basketball court. Standing tall amidst this collection of stars is the six foot six center of the Benil Blazers, Alan Liwa. In his debut game for Benil, Liwag did not disappoint as he tallied a 23-point, 18-rebound double-double while adding three blocks to his name. With a chance to retake the lead, he knows what up. Liwag, another putback by Alan Liwag. Against the defending champions, Liwag stood his ground, recording another double-double with 12 points and 14 rebounds plus three blocks. Once again, Benil Blazers winning against Letran Knights 83 to 78. Uh, hindi lumang uh, lamang ang Letran ng 10 to 0 on that first quarter, but Benil Blazers able to come back and uh, get an answer para umalago sa laban nito, lalo na on that uh, second uh, quarter. And right now, we will be with uh, the winning coach, Coach Charles Chu. And napakaganda ng uh, pinakita nitong uh, Benil Blazers coach. Ang uh, sinasabi nga namin ni Bo kanina, wala namang mawawala if ever dahil pasok naman na kayo going into the playoffs. Pero ano ba, yung uh, sinabi natin dun sa ating kupunan going into this game against the Hungry Latrana, kumakapit din dun sa kanilang Final Four contention. Well, we knew they'd be a desperate team. Siyempre, they're fighting for their Final Four life. Uh, kami mindset namin, they beat us twice already. Once a preseason, once a first round. So we knew it's gonna be a tough game. And actually, we're playing for the top two spot, di ba? Siyempre, it's a... Uh, a very big advantage. So, hindi pa kami na clinch the top. That's why we needed this game, and hopefully, we can win a few more to close the season. But Letran played great. Uh, thankfully, the boys were able to show some composure and find a way to win. And right after that first quarter barrage from uh, Letran coach, 10 to 0. Napagalitan ba itong mga uh, yung mga bata coach? Medyo, medyo lang naman. Pero <laughs> uh, let's leave it at that. Medyo. Buti na lang nag-respond sila. Bo? Hindi. Speaking of respond, doon sa yun nga, yung slow start. After no, tuloy-tuloy na hanggang sa matapos. Ano yung masasabi mo dun sa mga players mo na nag, talagang inano nila, kinayod nila itong panalong ito para sa CSB? Well, we, we kept reminding them, number one, how important yung game is to us. And then yung strong start ng Letran, part of it also was our fault kasi nagtatapon kami ng bola. So we talked about yung mga adjustments na gusto namin, kung paano namin sila atakihin. And um, thankfully, nag-adjust, nagawa ng bata. We did a good job passing the ball and you know, nasunog rin namin yung press nila. Coach, all season long, uh, first kayo dun sa assist department natin with 17.86 and right now, it above the average talaga, 30 assists for your for your team. Uh, isang aran si Ian Torres, eh, talagang sharing the ball ang mantra natin for today. Well, Ian played great for us off the bench. You know, his plus minus was huge. He really gave us a lift. Diba? And we talk about sharing the ball naman, uh, paulit-ulit, just make good basketball decisions. And yun yung naging libre kasi trap ng trap yung letran. They weren't letting us get into our offense. We had to really move the ball and we did and thankfully, uh, Maganda na yung pasahan after the first quarter. 
coach plan din ba na hayaan na lang tumira ng tumira si Pau Avilonar? And, and alam mo yun, yung iba, yung Jim Boy Estrada at yung iba pang uh, usual na tumitira for Letran ay nandepensa well, well, natin. Definitely not uh, credit to Pau, man. He's improved mm -hmm. so much his shooting throughout this season. I'm very impressed. I mean, 8 for 11, siguro 40%. Plus, na siya for the whole season. He, he shot the lights out, and I, after he made three, I was very upset every time we leave him open. But that's our fa our fault. We need to clean that up. But uh, obviously, our main priority was also Quahao and Estrada. Si Quahao no minute na naman ng dulo, but at least for the most part, we made Estrada really earn this, his points. And those those two are great players. But uh, credit to Pau, he had the 30 point game na naman. Sumikat na naman sa amin. Na, <laughs> but, pero, but credit to him, he's improved this game so much. Hindi, ako naman yung ano. Let's talk about Alin Liwag. Yep. Kasi nakita ko kanina nung third quarter, papasok na yung papalit. Talaga winnie wave off ni Alin. Pero paano mo nakokontrol yung emotion ni Alin na stay ka lang, relax ka lang. Uh, Kaya nga lang pa kont konti lang. I think maganda naman relationship kasi namin ni Alin. Sabi ko lang sa'yo, just trust me. No? I want to. I mean, si Alin kasi palagi sobrang fighter. Ayaw magpahinga niyan eh. Diba? But syempre, you also have to see pag napapagod na rin siya. It's also mm -hmm. for the better of the team. And at that time, wala naman si Javillionar. Sabi ko, gusto ko i-match up siya kay Javillionar. So sabi ko, let's just take a bit of a break. Mabalik naman siya. But uh, Alin played really well today also. Mm -hmm. Coach, nagugulat din kami kung gaano katas tumalon. Ito si Roger Ondoa. <laughs> Nakailang beses galing doon kay Ian Torres. Eh, talagang hinahanap. Yung dalawa kasi mag-best friend eh. Batman and Robin yan. Kaya palagi yung hinahanap ni Ian Torres. Eh. Pero sayang nga, di dinunk ni Roger yung isa. Sabi ko, dapat dinunk mo. But that guy can really fly. And Roger's been improving sa season. So I'm very happy with his progress. Coach, once again, congratulations. Eh, Siyempre, marami naghihintay ng iyong mga pabati dyan. Ah, of course, I thank the Lord first. And then uh, my family, my wife, uh, sila Boss Frank, Boss Jacob. Boss Andoy, those guys watching on TV, uh, Sir Eric, maraming sumusuporta sa amin. I really thank them for all the support and you know, sana patuloy ang pagsuporta ng Benilde community. It's uh, the stretch run for us. Hopefully you can come out and watch more games. Once again, our winning coach, Coach Charles Chu from uh, Benilde Blazers. Maraming salamat, Coach, and congratulations. Thank you. And uh, later, we will be talking about other players. At, uh, right, that's right after our break. Magbabalik ang NCAA Season 100. This is our league, this is our home.